Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. Now the PowerPoint style options allow you to be alerted when your presentation has stylistic problems with three key components. Visual clarity, spelling, and case and end punctuation. This simply allows you to assess how your presentation might appear overall the style options offer you no hard and fast rules about the visual clarity, those are just really suggestions. Now you can set your style options by once again selecting tools from the menu bar and rolling down to the options command. Give it a click to launch the options dialog box. On the spelling and style tab, to have PowerPoint check the style of your presentations in addition to your spelling, you first must make sure that check style is checked and it says that this uses the Office Assistant to offer suggestions about your presentation style. Would you like to enable the Office Assistant? And so you would need to enable the Assistant in order to view these suggestions. Then what you do is you click the Style Options button next. Here we'll, it will launch the Style Options dialog box and on the case and end punctuation tab you can choose what casing should be used for slide titles and select from the drop down and also your body text once again selecting from the drop down also your end punctuation should you even have slide title punctuation be checked if you do want it checked should it have punctuation or not if you don't care about checking an option, you can uncheck it so it will be skipped. Also for body punctuation, should it have it or not, or does it not matter as long as it's consistent? On the visual clarity tab, you have properties that, if adhered to, can sometimes make it easier to view a presentation. So for example, the number of fonts should not exceed how many. And if that's checked, you can input the number of fonts you wouldn't like to go over in the presentation over to the right. Also title text size should be at least how many points and body text size should be at least how many points. Also the legibility should the number of bullets per box not exceed and then check the number to the right or the number of lines per title should not exceed the number to the right or should the number of lines per bullet not exceed once again whatever number is set over in the right. Now once you had set up your case and end punctuation and visual clarity that you did want to check, you would click OK and then click OK. Now from that point on, when you have a slide that you view that breaks one of your stylistic rules, you'll see a little light bulb appear next to the offending item, just like a text box. There we go. So the office assistant will give you these tips. And you can click on one of them and then click the little light bulb that appears to see which rule is being broken. It will then tell you, enthusiastically, which one of these you're breaking. So here the punctuation in this placeholder is not consistent with your style checker settings. So here it's giving me the option of adding the end punctuation, removing it, ignoring the style rule for this presentation only or changing the actual rules and the options. And you continue to click and work your way through. Now when you're done with the office assistant you can right click him and hide him to make him go away. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachyoucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy to use training package. 
With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!